Hey, here we are again. America Deer Hunter DVM here. Um, we are going to the timber. I've got a score to settle with one um, before it gets too green. I've got a buck that I've been working on over the last calendar year that he's nothing special. Um, you know, he's not some out of this world 180 inch booner or anything screwball like that, but uh, he has me wrapped around his little finger because a he beat me last last year during the rut I was trying to film him and he came under my weak side and I had him right here at like hip pocket range and he was on this doe and I thought for sure I'd get a crack at him and he'd come around here to my right side where I had the strong uh, you know camera presence right there and he'd he totally got away from me, but that's okay because I killed two bigger bucks than him. But I, the number two reason I want to get after him because he's a absolute cold-hearted, black-hearted bully. He is a bastard, and uh, I'm going to wind up going in here and finding where he lives. And I'm going to go in there, and I am going to systematically dismantle him come next season. Uh, I'm going to do it, too. He's super visible, walks around with his head up like he's confident that nobody can kill him. He's not scared of anything, and he'll fight anything that moves, whether it's, you know, summer velvet, he'll rear up and strike with his, with his front hooves. Um, if it's the middle of the rut, he's beating the shit out of older bucks and bigger bucks um, that we want not to leave. And um, I don't know. If he wants to pick a fight, he can pick a fight with me. I'll go in there with a the decoy. If I can figure out a way to get it done without him seeing me, I'll go in there with a the fake to tune him up. So that's what we're doing. I need to go in and investigate a couple of spots where he bedded uh, last fall. And I'll be the first to tell you, I'm not liking what I've seen out of this spot. It looks cold as ice. But I'm going to go in here and find out. Let's go to work. All right, guys, I found a horn off of one. Uh, sorry, an antler off of one. I know who this guy is by looking at him. It's chewed all to shit, but it's Unibomb. Yep, let me take it, spin it around there. Yep, got him. That's the side I'm after. That damn squirrel's beating me on it, but this is why I'm here today. Right there, Unibomb. His brow time being G1, and well, a bomb because he's a piece of junk, and he beats the shit out of everything that everything that he comes in contact with. Awesome. I had an encounter with him, no joke, just down in there. Solid. Hell yeah. My tree stand is... <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna kill this son of a bitch next year. You watch. He survived it though. Awesome. That's great. Okay, it's about uh, three thirty. I've been in here kind of scouting this farm that I know that uh, a couple of shooter bucks live on, and I just found that bully buck. Uh, I found his shed antler over here, kind of down in the bottom, right, right where some of my tree stand placements were for the season so I know I'm in good shape let me show you where I think he's bedding and you guys tell me if I'm wrong here I'm gonna spin this camera around and I'll show you here in just a second okay so there's a bunch of this stuff on here in this area and it it's just covers the trees and the ground and um, I think it's what is called winter creeper um, but Look at this bedroom back in here. Let's go take a tour of it right here. The uh, Look at this big main trail that leads up into here. And there is a clear cut like, you know, vertical structure cap on top of this. Let's just go in here and look at it. Look how worn this is. Look how worn this is. Perfect little archway. Big old rub right there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, this is good stuff. Let's see if we can find us any hair in it. 
Well, what do you know? Looky here. Bingo. Don't know if you can see that, but there's definitely, yeah, there's a bunch of it here. Note to self, the old Unibom buck, he's going down right here. He puts himself at a disadvantage. It's so easy to get in here. You just sneak in this bottom and bust him when he comes out of this bed. So, um, really, really cool spot. One of my favorites. Uh, this little, kind of this area where this screwball uh, uh, cover is in here. It's pretty, it's pretty neat. I always, always really like to you know, pick on deer in here because they always, somebody's always in here bedding up during the season. So. Uh, good little spot. Catch you on down the road here just a little bit. We're going to keep going. Kind of a... That's a nice little antler. Nothing major. Ooh, pearl white on the end. Like that. Not too bad. Okay.